Hey everyone, it's Dr. Alessandro. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be answering a question that I've heard from a number of different patients. And they were asking, hey doc, is this, this stain that I got back here on one of my teeth, is that a cavity? So I do want to tell you right away, uh, very, very important first things first. Stain does not mean you have a cavity 100% of the time. So yes, it's something to look at. Yeah, you see it and it's very clear that there's something on your tooth, but stain in and of itself is not a cavity or decay. It can just be stain. Uh, for example, if you are a coffee drinker or a tea drinker, drink a lot of uh, dark berry juices like blackberry, things like that. Uh, well, wine, if you happen to drink wine, uh, those sorts of things. Those can all impart stain on our teeth and that may end up in the grooves of your teeth and so it might stain them. So stain is stain. It does not necessarily mean you have a cavity. Uh, however, you know, we do check. Of course, if you're concerned, we do check and we have a number of different ways of distinguishing whether or not it is a stain or it is a cavity. For example, the tried and true, you could say, Explore, the nails on chalkboard instrument. I know you guys all don't really like to hear the noise that it makes when we're kind of exploring and, and checking all of your teeth, but it is our Explore. And if I put this in a groove that has a stain and it is hard as a rock, typically it means that there isn't a, a cavity. It is just stain. Now I do say typically, sometimes there is. That's the reason why we use other tests in order to determine whether or not it is a cavity, such as x-rays, which I've discussed in a previous video. So the third thing we have uh, that we can use is a cavity indicating dye. Now, the cavity indicating dye uh, is a little bit uh, subjective again, uh, and it can be a more imperfect way of determining whether or not there's a cavity, but it is yet again, another way that we can kind of determine, yes, is this a cavity or no, it probably isn't a cavity. So there you have it. Um, those are the ways that we have to help determine whether or not we have cavities. Um, you know, I invite you, if you do have concerns to, of course, go and see your dentist. Uh, don't hold back. Go and see your dentist. Have them take a look. Have them, you know, use whatever methods they happen to have. Have them explain everything to you uh, because it may just be a stain. It doesn't always have to be a cavity. So again, thank you so much for joining me. It's Dr. Alessandro. Please like and subscribe and let me know how we're doing in the comments. And hope to see you again and hope that you're all staying well and healthy.